coming to you from the Pauling Library, so I have to wear my safety gear. Um, but uh, for this video, we're going to be talking about putting it all together. So we worked a really hard on all of our English skills, and we talked about plot and setting and conflict and themes and conclusions. And now we're going to be talking about putting our book together. So this is the cover of my book. So you can see it, and I have started mapping out my story. So I took the story that I wrote out on paper and I blocked it. So what you do with the story is you write it all out, and then you decide what um, parts of each story need to go on each page, and you draw a line, and you block out your story so that you know how many pages you need to make. So for my story, I then drew lines on all of these papers after blocking it and made it so each page had the material on it that I wanted. And then later on today and this week, I'm going to be drawing all of my pictures so that it's all ready for you for next week so that you can see the different um pages and I can read you my story and we can talk about how you can share your story with everyone in your life. So, um, in your baggies this week you got all sorts of supplies. Once you're finished blocking your story, you can either take the strips that you cut out and glue them directly on each page or you can rewrite it. And then in this spot, this is where your pictures go. So you can either um, draw your own pictures, which is what I'm going to do, or you can take pictures from magazines and make a collage, or you can take pictures from the internet and make and glue them on that way. I gave you a glue stick for that, so that should be fun. Or you can do a mix, really. You can do whatever you want. You can draw with pencil, you can draw with markers, you can draw with crayons. So, I'm going to get started on mine this week and I'm going to put it all together for you so that I can read it to you next time. And I can't wait to see what yours um, come out to look like. I hope everybody will send me pictures so that I can see them because um, I'm sure that your stories are beautiful and I can't wait to see them. So I hope you guys have a great week and let me know if you have any questions or need any help with anything. I'm just an email away. Have a great day. Bye!